I know everything's always working out for me, and what do you do? <laughs> you relax and accept the abundance. Okay, no, that's... Yeah. You relax and accept the good timing of things. You acknowledge the perfection of the way your life unfolds. Here's something that would be really helpful for you to know. When you remember that your inner being has your back and that your inner being knows what you want and that the cooperative components have been gathered, then you don't fret over the details. You let these greater forces, this broader knowing tend to things and you put yourself in the most receptive mode. We're talking about humans in general. You are action oriented and you are used to making things happen with your action. But look what happened today. You rendezvoused, you rendezvoused. And we want each of you to take credit for your part in this rendezvous because it was a collective consciousness rendezvous. And that's what's always happening. If you could not need to know the details, in other words, Esther was not demanding any itinerary for the rendezvous with that magnificent calving. She felt it coming. She wanted so much for it to be there, but she kept holding herself in that sort of calm place, a sort of attitude of whatever will be, will be, and it will be good. Whatever will be, will be, and it will be good. Whatever will be, will be. Things are always working out for me. That is the vibrational atmosphere that you're wanting to conjure as often as you can.